Rafael Cuenca here with DepthTap.com. Today we are interviewing Arthur Sudiem, um, the acclaimed illustrator of Marvel Zombies. Uh, so Arthur, um, can you please tell us about your uh, early influences and what inspired you to uh, jump into the zombie aspect of the Marvel co comics? I'd seen some, uh, some of the drawings, charcoal drawings, crayon drawings of uh, Michelangelo and Leonardo da Vinci when I was a kid. And then I started reading comic books. Well, I was attracted to both uh, were the anatomy. Uh, and one of the things I liked about comic books, probably what most kids, most boys do, is like all the guys with the muscles, all the muscle men running around. What about the, what about the women with the breasts? I, I didn't notice those until much later, until much later in life. I didn't, didn't notice those bumps. <laughs> the ones I liked the best that stick in my memory were the uh, Stan Lee, Steve Ditko, and Jack Kirby books. So what do you say to the, uh, the, the young, talented artist that wants to follow a similar career path as you? You get out of it what you put into it. Drawing is a skill just like carpentry. You know, talent is something different. Talent is kind of what you do with the skill once you have it. It has its pluses. It has its minuses. You know, one of the pluses is you get to come to shows like this. I think this show in particular, this, this show that we're at here, there are a lot of good guys around. The guy right behind me, I'm going to buy one of his drawings uh, yeah, after this show's over. Is there anything you're working on right now or anything you can tell us about? I have my own zombie miniseries that I've been working on. I started it about 10 years ago and I just keep getting sidetracked. I'm about halfway through it now. Also uh, called Mudwogs, it's a, a, a fantasy thing. Uh, it's about 200 pages long. Uh, that one I'm almost done. Now I've probably got eight more pages. Another miniseries that I've been working on just came out recently. I wrote it, did all the interiors. That's called The Adventures of Child and Flytrap. That's uh, through Radical Publishing. Received really well by the critics. It's getting a lot of critical acclaim. Actually, at one of these shows, at one of these shows I was at a couple months ago, a guy is opening up his own restaurant, and he wanted me to design his, uh, his characters for his logo. I said, sure. He has a restaurant called uh, Grateful Taco. It's in Texas. The logo character for the entire restaurant is a zombie. Straight from the horse's mouth. Hippies, zombies, tacos. Grateful Here we are. Dead. <laughs> the Grateful Dead. Thank you very much, Arthur. Appreciate that. Thank, Thank you. you so much.